What is up guys? It's Kids Us from Coastland and today we're at Playlands Castaway Pier or Cove, whatever. Anyways, this is this is round two. I can't speak right now. I just woke up from a nap. Okay, so this is round two. We tried the first time, it poured and thunderstormed and Oh that's right, and we were in line. And we were next in line to ride Gale Force. Today the weather looks better than it did the last time. It was almost guaranteed the rain the last time, so that kind of gives you that idea. Um, oh, that was cool. Yeah. Holes in there. Back. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're going to head over to Gale Force immediately. There's no way I'm missing that credit. We'll cross whatever bridge we have to next afterwards, but we're getting there first. So, all right. It's very compact car. Oh, they have an air race. I forgot they have an air race. That's an air race. I know what the problem is. I don't know what it is. It loops you repeatedly while spinning you around. Oh, thank you, no, I'm not driving that. Yeah, I kind of want to ride that. I'm going to ride the air race tonight, too. Although, considering I just ate something, maybe not the best idea, but if I vomit, it's good content. But anyways, guys, we're going to head over to Gale Force and take a ride on what might be the best boardwalk coaster we've ridden so far. It'll be tough to beat uh, Great White and it'll be tough to beat the Great Nor'easter, but hey, uh, it could. It is a compact launch coaster, swing launch, goes around twice, which I find very interesting. The park made that decision. Didn't originally do that, I don't believe. But, uh... Popcorn. Yeah. But yeah, guys, uh, I'll see you over at Gale Force. It's, uh, built by s, &S. Well, I guess then there'll be a lot of ear banging unless you break your neck first. Yeah, what you want. Send you twice. Oh my gosh, this is awesome! Oh my god, oh my god. Oh man! Oh man. Oh my god. Wow. I love you. That is that is an elite roller coaster. Alright 
guys as you saw we got off gale force and wow what a ride that's top 25 for sure um i'm thinking not only gale but like category 5 hurricane yeah that was a ridiculously intense compact and aggressive throw ride uh 10 out of 10 for me there's no oh, question, yeah. Oh, yeah. No question. <laughs> that's one of the greatest rides i've ever ridden and it that's is probably the single greatest ride i've ever ridden that's your favorite coaster i don't know about my favorite coaster let me let me let that percolate a while but yeah. just for the for the sheer fun factor everything factor everything was perfect it was a little rattly but it didn't take away from the ride at all not to mention the fact that even if it was rattly yeah i'm just trying to figure out how we get to the enf miler coaster yeah we might have to go all the way around i don't know but yeah guys gale force just blew me away uh that was, that was I've heard rumors about how great that back row ride is. When we got assigned the back row, my heart like skipped a beat in happiness and it did not disappoint. Some of the greatest ejector airtime of all time yeah. comes on that Easily. ride. Easily. That, the, there were three airtime moments on that ride that are in my top five airtime moments. I mean, it was that good. It, it really is an elite, perfect is ride. No, I can't. I don't see it. We'll have to ask somebody. But yeah, uh, guys, that was awesome. Really, really awesome ride. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I just can't say it enough. That was awesome. Alright guys, so onwards, but definitely not upwards. There's no way we can go up from that. I said onwards, but definitely not upwards. No, I don't think we can beat that this whole trip. Let's just go home. <laughs> uh, Superman the ride at New England might. No. Apparently the greatest intimate hyper coaster, some will say. So it won the golden ticket award for best roller coaster four times, so we'll see. But uh It's because they didn't have that one in there. Gale Force, I don't even think won best new ride. It might have, but I don't think it did. Which I think it that's because in its opening year it was so unbearably rough they ripped the entire thing down and rebuilt it they rebuilt the entire ride okay so that's part of it all right guys i'll see you in a bit but wow just wow we're gonna try to find wild ways the enf miler uh coaster see you in a bit hey guys can you see quick see both watch your arms you're good I didn't say that. I said Ian F. Myler. Good air time. Yeah. Nice floater. Yeah. Again, it's about all of it. Yeah, but <laughs> something was changing. Science is there. Right at the end. Alright y'all, 
we just got off Wild Waves, and Wild Waves is a pretty good coaster. Nice, definitely the best miler coaster I've ridden, that's for sure. And uh, now we're gonna hit this, a SBF spinning coaster, as you can see right here. We've hit way too many of these already, but here's another one, so let's get the credit. Uh, and uh, I'll see you in a bit. The one in front of us, unless it's already on the curve. Are, you, are we going to get a re-ride on Gale Force before you go to the car? I don't know. How many tickets do you got? Enough. You gave me an extra four tickets. Oh, I did? Oh. Thank you. No problem. I think it was folded together the four thing. Wow, look at that shot. I don't honestly remember, but it was a pretty decent amount. I think it was over a hundred, but I won't swear. May have been over two, I don't know. We got, I think I got their biggest or their second biggest package, I don't remember which. I'm getting tired of these. I am so tired of these. They're such a gimmick. And there's like a hundred of them built or something. And why is it that we got to do They're a credit. Also, I will say, the uh, it's a smoother transition into the tires on this one. I will say that. All right, guys, so after Whirlwind, we're heading to find the last coaster credit we need. Not even sure if we're allowed on this one. It is a kid's coaster, but uh, like a true kid's coaster. So we'll have to see if they let us on it. Um, there's Air Race. Uh, trying to figure out. I do not have any clue where this is. Oh, right over here. All right, guys. All right. 
looks like he basically walks the track and makes sure nobody runs into it. That guy over there. So, but yeah, there's Pirates Gold Rush. It's a true kiddie coaster. Also an ENF miler. All right, guys. There it is. Right there. So let's uh, let's get ready to go. See you on the ride, guys. I know. This is a kitty coaster though, so. Yep, and it only costs two tickets to ride if you want to ride it. <laughs> That, that's a flat pipe I wanted to ride for a while. That's a jumper. A little bit of air time though. Yeah. Oh, and it goes backwards too? Wow. kids coaster it's all right i mean it's there it's but, there but that means we have all four credits uh you going for a rerun on gale force or are you drained i'm not drained but i i kind of like a rerun on gale force right, we already got all the good seats yeah we got the apparently the front doesn't have the same ejector but you might walk out and get the back again. It's up to you.
gonna get one ride and go back to the car, or are you gonna do what? I need to do some flat rides. How many is some? Well, I don't know. Maybe not that one, but it should move quick ish. But alright, guys, we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do. I'll see you in a bit. Alright, guys, so Papa decided to sit with this one out for obvious reasons, but we're gonna go on the Park Sam Parallel Air Race. This is the first time I've done one of these, so I'm interested to see how it rides. Looks like a decent ride, looks like it might have some force and a lot of inversions, so definitely excited to ride this attraction. So let's, uh, Let's do this. See you on the ride, guys. Alright, guys. Damn parallel air race. This is my first one. Not sure what to expect. I know what it does, but that doesn't really tell me forces or anything else. So, we'll have to see. That's cool, they come down automatically. Ah, uh, here we go. I'm a little nervous. POV is going to be weird, just flipping upside down a bunch of times. Wow. It's okay, but it's not really intense. Good hang time though. Oh man. Oh. Alright guys, so just got off air race. 
the Zamperla Air Race, inventive name for Air Race. They named it the literal model name. It's the Zamperla Air Race called Air Race. Which, by the way, happens a lot with this particular flight ride. But yeah, Air Race. Air Race was a decent ride. Um, wow, that was loud. That was really loud. That was insanely loud. Okay. Anyways, Air Race, really decent ride, great hang time, but no real positive force, which is really what I look for in flat rides, is that positive G-force, and there was absolutely none on Air Race. Uh, it, it was pretty forceless in that regard. But the hang time, I guess if you count that as a force, it's a negative force, then yeah, it did pretty well there. But I definitely prefer uh, positive G-force flats probably like that k is that kmg no i don't know who built that claw over there maybe for breeze then parallel maybe i have no clue i've seen one like that uh similar structure last night i wrote it as you guys saw but uh yeah i'm not sure what i do know is air race decent flat would i ride it again Eh, maybe but it does make you a little dizzy because all the blood does go to your head all right, guys, we're probably going to get a rewrite on Gale Force. And, what I'm going to uh, do, I don't know what, I'm not doing anything other than that. Yeah. We're going to get a rewrite on Gale Force. I'll see you in a bit. Oh, my bad. Alright, here we go. Did it break down? I don't know. Oh, here we go. into my top 15 with that ride i had room they didn't staple me and wow that ride kicked butt in so many ways uh, that was a great ride it's such an elite roller coaster it's one of the greatest rides on earth i really do believe that um to, for things to get into my top 15 is not easy not like it used to be back when i had Lot, a lot less credits like 50 60 credits it was easy for things to kind of fly under my radar or not fly under my radar but be like 
oh, this is great. I don't know why it's a fly under my radar, but now it's harder to impress me because I've ridden some of the greatest thrill rides at some of the greatest parks in the United States. So, yeah, that was our second time. But yeah, we we definitely, uh, and we both love that uh, coaster so freaking much. It is elite, and uh, yeah. So I was gonna ride some more fly rides, but I'm feeling a little dizzy after that because it was so intense. So I think we're gonna call it a night, and yet again, we have leftover tickets. I might have enough tickets for a whole nother coaster trip back up here. That's how many tickets left over from each of the ticketed parks pay by ride I have. So yeah, guys. Uh, that's gonna do it from Playlands Castaway Cove. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, click that like button down below. And remember to subscribe. Yeah, good meeting you. Yeah. And uh, until next time, peace, guys.